guys welcome welcome back to my youtube channel this is me alicia if this is your first time here and if not welcome back all right so we are back with another haul i recently did a oh let's do a quick round robin of my look and then let's get into like the actual video all right really quickly my hair is a wash and go i will link i've been using the exact same products olaplex and curl days i'll link those exact same ones um and i also link them in the order although i think it's pretty much self-explanatory but i'll link them in the order that i use them in hopes that that like helps you guys out um my foundation is charlotte tilbury flawless filter i'm in 14 warm chod i will link that um, my lippy is a combination of MAC. I was hoping I could easily grab it, but it's like on the other side. Um, MAC, Vino in the liner, and then Praline in the NYX Butter Gloss, and then all of my jewelry is my own. This is actually a sweater that I have recently did a sweater haul. I'll link that either up here or in the description box to go check that out. It is everything, and you guys know I don't do a lot of color, but this is like, it's kind of like a muted, like a baby blue. I'm obsessed with it. So, that's out of the way let's get into the video as i was saying before we have another haul i did a sweater haul or like a dress sweater knit type dresses haul one or two videos ago this is going to be all about my ever-growing boot collection ignore the dye dr pepper here i needed it <laughs> um but yeah just basically some of the boots that i have bought this season this is not all of them i just really pointed out six of the main ones that i've been like either wearing often or i'm like i'm definitely gonna have to get those um they're just a good just a good i love a good boot one of my girlfriends in dallas her boot collection is immaculate i can never touch hers but i'm trying to kind of grow my own so let's just get into the details i'm going to pop up a side by side of me of me actually trying to boot on i'll give you brands i'll give you where i got it from i'll try to give you prices and then of course i'm going to give you links so let's just hop right into oh i'm also going to do like not least a favorite because i i like them all because why else would i have them but like i don't know i'll list them in order of like how much i love them maybe anyway let's get into the video all right so first ones up we have these taupe slouchy boots that i got from target i really only got these for two reasons one because i saw on the reviews that they were actually really really comfortable and i realized that while i have a lot of boots i don't have the wear all day kind of boot or the be able to like do errands all day or do errands and then do coffee and then like i don't have an all day boot because i'm not really a big heel person and so after a while i'm like okay i'm ready to take these off so i wanted a boot that i can be able to wear all day and still look cute and chic so that's one reason why i got them and the second reason they were on sale at target half off so i did get these from target i did get them in an eight and a half which is normally it really just depends i i normally get my boots and my sneakers at an eight and a half and then every other thing every other shoe like heels and flats in the nine i don't know why my foot is differently but i was able to get these in an eight and a half and i love them i've worn them i just got them for i got them a week or two before thanksgiving because they were like they were half off and i want to say i've already worn them like three times they're a really good like I said, wear all day boots. I wore them when I went to go get my brows done and then I went and did some errands around the city and then I went and met a girlfriend later for like a happy hour type thing. And I was in them all day and didn't feel an ounce of hurt. So definitely love these. They have the zipper on the side. They're just a, nothing fancy. I just think they're really cute boot. They have a little bit of a slouch so it gives them a little bit of detail but I thought it was just a cute general overall boot Probably. okay i've decided i'm not gonna do them in order of importance let's just do them according to like the brand so this is another pair that i also got from target once again i just think target has some really good all day comfortable everyday type boots and so i picked these up i've actually had these for quite a while so i'm hoping that they're still available i want to say i got them in september yeah, once I got these in September, right, when they had some version of a sale. And the reason why I got them is because I was following, 
I can't remember. I was on Instagram looking through the reels and I saw a reel that had like thick calf boots and it was a reel and one of those mentioned these particularly from Target and what I like and I'll get close so you guys can see it and I don't think these had it. Oh, they did. The first ones did. So if I get, if you get right here, let's see if I can. So if you get right here, it just looks like a part of the boot, but this part is elastic. So it kind of, it can really work with the wide calves. And I have thick calves. I mean, some people don't think I do. I, th I have thick calves because there have been several boots, okay, that have politely told me, no ma'am and no thank you because it would not fit my calves. So I like that these look like a sh normal chic boot but then they can expand for the wide caps absolutely love these okay um, that's it for target let's move on to walmart yes i know walmart really quickly this is not sponsored or air anyway although i would appreciate it if you did um but walmart especially walmart online like my local walmart basura okay but walmart online the clothing has been so good so i did a collaboration with walmart sometime in november and i was able to go online and pick out my selections and i saw these boots and i immediately had to have them i knew what look i was going for when i was doing the walmart collab it was just a matter of like finding which pieces i wanted to get and so when i came across these boots yes they are everything and then some so and i did not have a dark brown boot so i picked these dark brown boots up i did get them in a nine um because for these these actually fit perfectly in a nine and i love that they are definitely thick or wide calf or wide they're very they're very curvy girl friendly because i do have the wide here there's not any like stretch that the target ones have but i you know you can cl clearly tell that's enough for wide calf this actually goes above the knee I've been wearing it both ways. I've been wearing them above the knee, but then when I want like a more casual, edgier look, I kind of slouch them down. So they kind of still give me the slouch look. They're just really good. It's a prime example. I have been wearing the mess out of these boots. Look at that. It has nothing to do with the quality. They're literally scraped because I have been between me and my older sister who has been stealing them. These boots have just been everything. They are definitely comfortable. I've been able to wear these all day. I sh it's just, it's really good. I actually took these down when me and my husband went to Destin and I was able to do all the things. We went for lunch and then we went shopping at the outlets and then we went somewhere else before we went and got, oh, went by the wine store and then we went and got dinner and I was in these all day. It was definitely worth every single dollar that I paid for them. Okay, let's move on. We got Target, Walmart, let's grab, let's do Nordstrom Rack. All right, Nordstrom Rack. I will say, caveat, while I am absolutely obsessed with these boots, they are very hard to get on. I don't know why they didn't come with a zipper. Like, legit all the other ones did every other one had a zipper these don't but i i'm obsessed with them i'm obsessed with the color so i i push through <laughs> so i got these from nordstrom rack i was about to say nordstrom nordstrom rack they are the brand i want to say dolce vita i want to confirm i gotta look all the way in that boot oh my gosh i can't see down there dv yeah Dolce Vita and I absolutely love these I did get these in a um a nine only because the reviews on the website was like get your size unless you have wide calves and then get a size up so you'll be able to put it over your foot so I'm thinking okay if I get a nine that should work the only thing this has helped is you know how like back in the day your mom used to have like those stocking socks like they're not the thick boot socks they're basically they're like stocking socks I had to go buy a pair of those. I had never, I normally, one, I don't really carry socks in the first place. I don't like to wear socks. I probably have three pairs of socks in my entire wardrobe. It's just me and socks, we just, ugh, I'm not a sock person. Only because most of my <laughs> shoes, sandals, mules, don't require socks. So now that I've been wearing boots, I'm like, all right, I'll go get a pair of boots. Boots. So I have like a regular pair of socks. I have a, like a pair of boot socks, and then now I have a pair of stocking socks. 
I want a pair of like no show for the gym, but I'm not really a sock person. Anyway, got these. I was, I did have to get a stocking sock and it makes it a lot easier to slide on. Don't try to put this boot on barefoot or don't try to put this boot on with a cotton sock. You know, it's not gonna work. It's absolutely immaculate. I love the details. I love the color. I love that you have like the combination of the brown and the black. It's definitely a boot and it 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 hits what it needs to hit, but it's a struggle to get on, okay? Sit down to put this boot on. Don't try to stand up to put this boot on. You don't want that kind of pressure in your life. <sighs> Once you actually get it on, it is a comfortable shoe. It's not an all for me. It's not an all day shoe because I feel the heel is a little taller. Um, but it's definitely a, I don't know, three to four, three to four, five hour type shoe, three to four. I went, let's not go there, Alicia, not five hours, but definitely a good, I say a statement shoe. So when I wear these, I really keep the rest of the outfit muted. So jeans and a t-shirt, all black. I really keep the outfit muted because I kind of want these to speak for themselves and they talk very, very loudly. So love these. All right, so we did Nordstrom Rack. Let's actually do Nordstrom. And these shoes, y'all, where am I going? Where am I going with these shoes? <laughs> I was in Nashville. I went to Nashville with Kiosha for her birthday. And we did what we always do when we were out of town. We went shopping. And I went into Nordstrom because I wanted to look at some of the mules that Steve Madden had. And two of the mules that I looked at, they didn't have sizes. So I'm like, ugh. So I'm in like a pity party because I want shoe. They're like, oh, we can order it for you. I'm like, I want immediate gratification. I want to walk out with these things today because I want to wear them tonight. <laughs> so they didn't have what I'm looking for. Now I'm just like looking for random things. And I came across these shiny, sequency boots. And I fell in love. And I don't know why I fell in love. You guys know there is nothing about this shoe that says Alicia's color palette. But I love them, so I got them. I have only worn these once, and that was to a, a random ASS dinner that William decided, hey, let's just run here. And I had on, like, my outfit was so muted, I had on a white blouse with some jeans, and I had these on. These are definitely an occasion sneaker, unless, or occasion boot. Unless you're that girl and you just think every day is an occasion. And that's fine. You do what you need to do. For me, she, her, we aren't wearing these every day. But when we do wear them, okay, we will be wearing them. <laughs> So I picture these, like I said, I did wear them one time randomly um, to dinner and that's cause William's like, you're not finna wear those. What you're not finna do is bet me, bet I'm wearing them. And I had like, as soon as I walked in the door, the, who's the lady that greets you before they sit you down? Hostess, host? The lady at the restaurant was like, oh my God, I love your boots. I got like four compliments on my boots while I was there. And most of the time I was sitting down. So definitely love these. So I picture myself wearing these on occasion. We're having a book club Christmas party coming up. It's like an ugly sweater. So I'll probably wear it there. Whatever we're doing for New Year's, I'll probably there wear it there. It's definitely an occasion boot, but I love it because it's, it's a statement. Like this, you, you immediately are intrigued when you see this. You see this and you're just like, oh, I wonder what kind of person she is. <laughs> that that's my thinking when i saw the boot anyway they are by steve madden they are not true to size people i want to say i had to get yes i had to get a nine and a half only because my i don't think my feet are wide i think my feet are normal this is definitely like a narrow type boot you see how narrow that is so i would recommend going up at least a half a size like i said i normally an eight and a half so i was like oh okay they look like they're narrow let me get a nine no it it was tight so i went ahead and got a nine and a half this is a heel so this isn't an all-day heel unless you like this kind of thing but it's definitely one of those like an occasion type thing i love them. okay let's move on to the last boot which i've been wearing quite a bit anyway so the last boot is this cute it i don't know what color it's looking like on the screen i'm getting like a deep gray but it's not this is like a true this is like an olive green boot the brand is calvin klein i don't think i've ever had calvin klein 
boot. I don't think I've ever had Calvin Klein anything besides like undergarments. And that's why I like shopping in a department store. So I got these from a department store called Belk. It's a regional department store. Um, but I'm pretty sure you can get it anywhere, whatever your local department store is. So I was in Belk. I wanted to look at some more boots. Um, and I saw these and I'm like, yes and please love these heel is a cute black heels definitely an all-day heel I love the boot the sock version so it kind of like sticks you know it's fitted to your leg this is just this is my favorite boot this is my favorite boot that I've gotten thus far I've only had this boot I got this boot the day after no I didn't I got this boot not black Friday not iron bowl Saturday I got this boot the Sunday so what is that just a regular sunday <laughs> we have the thing so it's like thursday of course it's thanksgiving thursday and then it's black friday and then it's iron bowl saturday that's the thing in this household so i got these the day after that so a regular 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 sunday i got these sunday after thanksgiving i've already worn them four times and it's only december the 6th love these i've worn these with absolutely everything i've worn them i've been normally just wearing them with like sneakers uh not sneakers like uh skinny jeans i have worn them with a pair of joggers that i have so i kind of like cinch the jogger up so you can actually see the full boot because i love how people are jazzing up the joggers and i wanted to see if i could do it and i did it and i'm upset that i didn't take any pictures or video of it I'm like, oh my God, I was able to do it. But I was kind of like rushing out because, you know, William's rushing me and I got the kid and I'm just like, but I was cute when I was there. So I need to re go ahead and repeat that outfit. Anyway, love these. These are definitely a cute, comfortable all day shoe. And like I said, if you can't, maybe I'll try to do the stock photo because these are definitely like a true, maybe you can see it here, true olive green. So this green that you see here, that's the entire shoe. It just looks a little weird when you put the fabrics on camera, but love these all right so guys that is the end of this video i hope you guys have enjoyed this random boot haul i'm me and boots my next obsession i don't even know if you guys want it but i've been into sneakers lately and let me tell you why having a kid and going places with the kid and still wanting to be cute is a lot if i'm wearing mules like there was we were out one day and i had on my cute mules and i was trying to get out of the car and get his his little bag out of the car and remember to get my bag and i slid straight out of one of my mules i'm like Ugh. so i'm still going to be wearing the mules don't get it twisted she's still wearing mules i just now realize that i also like other kind of shoes sneakers is also one of them so in the last month i want to say i've gotten well not the last month since november so last month and a half i want to say i customized some from nike i got a pair of dunks husband got me a pair of ones while I, he was in houston i got another pair of dunks while we were in destin and i got just a pair of reeboks while we were in destin and then i've gotten six pair of sneakers in a month and a half Something is wrong with me. Something is wrong with you. What are you doing? Living my life. So that's <laughs> that's it. If you guys want to see the little sneaker collection that I have, I am not a sneakerhead. Please don't put that title on me because I don't want y'all coming for me. I like what I like. I don't like what I don't like. I hate a, hate a high top shoe. So it's definitely your low type type shoe. If you guys want that, let me know. I'll probably stick it in like another random daily vlog that I've been doing and obsessed with lately. So yeah, let me know. Um, like I said, I, if you have reached the end of this video, you have not subscribed, please don't forget to subscribe i will make sure that i link absolutely every boot that i showed here i want to say i showed six one two three four five yeah i showed six so i'll make sure that i link those and then if i can't find the exact same thing i will link good compliments suggestions all that kind of stuff so while you're here guys go ahead and like comment and subscribe and do all the things that the other youtubers tell you to do i'm gonna catch you guys next sunday seven o'clock